<laughs> What's up everybody? It's me Stevie Boy and I am here in New York City. I am getting ready right now to go to Whoopi Goldberg's luncheon um, to talk about my book. I'm solo this time, you know, in this vlog. I don't have my team of 20,000 people so I'm like rolling all by myself. But I just got my hair done and um, something different, you know, I want to change it up, switch it up, do something a little new. But I'm going to this lunch and I'm really excited about it. Um, I haven't seen Whoopi in a couple months, so this is going to be a nice little mini reunion. So yeah, stay tuned. Alright you guys, so I just finished my luncheon with Whoopi Goldberg and Tom Lee and Artis and Michael Musto was there and a long list of other great people. I didn't want to vlog it because it was a personable moment, so I didn't want to pull my camera out, but I showed you guys some photos. Hope you enjoyed them. I was supposed to have a meeting um, in Times Square, but unfortunately something crazy happened. So now I'm heading back to the hotel to get prepared. I just got asked tonight to speak at uh, Rainbow's Fashion Week panel. Uh, see me at the Burnick. So you guys, as I check into the room, I got this amazing little note from David. It says, welcome back, buddy. So glad you are back, David. Thank you, Mr. Lopez. All right, you guys, I just checked into the Burning Hotel, and which you know I love. Thank you, David Lopez. But guess who I have with me today? One of the best models, I don't know, let's say, in the universe. The legendary, the serving of the face, Adairi. Mr. Corey Wade. We're back together. Hi, really um, And it feels so good. Talk about your album. Oh my god, okay, so I've been away. Uh, in an art incubator working on a passion project of mine. You pulled uh, a Mary J. Blige, you went to London. That's right. Is that and did a whole I album. I guess I, I just made that up. I recorded an album in London with um, Alan Glass, and he's famous yes. for working with Aretha Franklin mm -hmm. and The Temptations and Jennifer Holliday. And uh, it's going to come out at the end of August. So yes. get ready for that. The end of August, and you need to call me music video. I'm styling, I'm doing something. And you're starring. And do you have any dark songs on there? Wait, should I be sharing this? Should I yeah. turn this off? Okay, do you I have mean, like any dark songs where I can just have a reason to put you in like corsets that are spiked out? And you like know what dramatic we should do? Pieces? I wrote a song that's kind of like SNME. There we go. That's, 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 that's where I was trying to go. That's what we should do. All right, you guys. Well, we're going to talk business and life and catch up and I'll holla at you. Bye. So me and Corey, Corey, what do we order, honey? Oh, it's just the tequila soda with lime juice. Oh my God, y'all, look who just walked in. I can't. Lexi, hey, baby. Hi. Hey. Hi, Corey. Hi, Steven. How are you? <laughs> yes. All right, I got to be honest, y'all, we think that we've been sitting here. Yo, she's been here. We just needed to re-intro her. We need to re-intro. But just ignore all of that. It was so, it was so, like she put energy, she dipped it, she dipped it low, bring it up slow. So we are at the rooftop here at the Burnick Hotel and they just opened. I am going to be doing, well, I'm going to be um, doing my men's fashion week show here July 12th or 13th uh, at the penthouse as well as the rooftop. So I'm going to have, oh my bad. So um, I'm actually going to have and utilize up, up and down spaces, multiple spaces. So stay tuned to that. Bye, I'm trying to drink. All right, cheers, you guys. Clank, 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 clank. What are we cheersing to, Lexi? We are cheersing to reunion of fabulous friendship. Yes. Massive success. Yes. Peace, happiness. Yes. All things fabulous. Wow, that's amazing. I would like to thank Sonic Blend for this amazing watch. All right, thank you. It is now. awesome. You guys gotta check this thing out. So, um, you guys, I just found out that there's another balcony. And where, it was hidden. I didn't even realize it was another balcony. Isn't that crazy? And I just did my makeup, so if you're wondering, like, wait, you look so different. Hi! It's Corey. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? I mean, that's so random. So you guys, right now I am about to go to George's Barbecue, and I'm very excited. I love this part of town. You got to check it out. It's awesome. And uh, look, 
this is where I'm at. So I came here to basically eat and review the place. Uh, thank you to the owner, Alan, you're awesome. Um, I love, love, love this part of town. Like, it's so amazing. It's always crowded, full of people, you know, really intense. But uh, yeah, so I think I'm gonna get, they have a special today, it's just chef salad. It's black and chicken, bacon and ranch type of style. I'm gonna get that and get some crispy broccoli with it. So let's check that out. All right. I miss my oh my god. Deep fried weed. Deep fried marijuana. Deep fried marijuana. With some marijuana. cocaine yeah. salt. Yeah. With I'm that putting music. Okay, you guys, I just left Georgia's. It was amazing. The food was great. So now we're just walking through, you know, the area, trying to figure out what we're going to do next. All right, so we just left Georgia's and now we're heading to an undisclosed location. Yeah. Anyone has any like words? Well, we love you all. Thanks for watching. When we get there and you see video of the space, it will be undisclosed. <laughs> it's still going to be undisclosed. So until then it's disclosed. It's cl it is closed. Is closed, open, and undisclosed. But great, we're all open. But for we are. Business. <laughs> but in the rhyming aspect, we are clothed. Are we clothed? Or do you even have any clothes on? Because I know I don't. I look like I have no pants on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Bye. I am back in the hotel today. It was amazing. I'm back here at the Burdick, and I am uh, probably going to go to rest. For tonight but let me show you something that is really important I showed you earlier but let me show you at nighttime this is the view it's gorgeous I love this view of the city at night this is true relaxation man this is relaxation and I love it and I'm just grateful just love every moment of it so I think I'm about to relax in my beautiful comfortable bed and get some R's catch some if I can um, it's quite early. I thought I was going to be out a lot later tonight, but apparently I'm not. I'm going to turn in early because I have a lot of business and work to do. I have BeautyCon this Saturday. Excited about that. And um, yeah, so stay tuned and I hope everyone out there is enjoying the vlog so far. Peace. It is day two here in NYC at the Burnick Hotel. My favorite place to stay. I am planning my day out right now. I'm trying to figure out exactly what I'm going to be doing. Um, I know what I'm going to be doing, but I just got asked to do like eight more things. Tonight I'm doing something that I can't film, but I do want to share information about it. It's called The Box. And uh, I've been going for a very long time. But just look it up, and if you're ever in New York, go to it. I'm telling you, it's nothing that you can Google. It's nothing that you can see online. It's only like a thing you can only like experience like in person. One of the few things that the millennials haven't taken over and ruined, no shade to my generation, but like we can kind of ruin some things. There's no, like no more personal secretive aspects of life anymore. When you go to a nightclub or like a situation or a, a theater, you're not supposed to watch it online. Like that's called bootlegging. That's neither here or there. I'm gonna get ready, brush my teeth, uh, start my day. And uh, yeah, stay tuned. shoot I'm doing a, like an impromptu photo shoot with a couple friends here in New York City um, 
this is one company, Ellie Vale. Make sure you look her up. I'm going to include her in the description. She sent me these amazing accessories. I really appreciate it. Thank you, hun. And um, yeah, so I'm going to, you know, see what happens and create some magic. So stay tuned to that. Okay, so currently right now we are shooting. I can't really show you too much because everyone's kind of like naked, I guess, or dressing. I'm into the abs. Uh, like you with the corset on, I'm into that. That's do we, the same thing. Do we have... Which one? The corset, the leather? Oh, no, no, that, 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 that like... Because, because it's actually a... a Oh my gosh. I'm just getting in from the box and I had a great time. Thank you so much, K Bonds and you're amazing as usual. It's just like a breath of fresh air for me. Oh gosh, that was fun. I needed that. Um, but yeah, you guys, I'm I'm basically back um, from that. So let me lay my little face down. Honest? No, first of all, not be really honest. Just be real in general. The sun has already risen. You see that blue light? That's the sun. That is not a light. I have two hours of sleep, as usual. Sometimes less. Well, so 30 minutes. But I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make it work. Good night. Bye. Okay, you guys, so I am in Washington Square Park. It's gorgeous out here on a Saturday. Yeah, very Beautiful. Oh my god, they're coming your way. <laughs> so make sure you try out Washington Square Park when you're in New York. I actually never came to this park. Well, I have. But I'm not going to tell you what I was doing in this park. <laughs> Excuse me. Get out the way. Get out the way. Excuse me, I have to get to my kids. <laughs> Lexi, can we tell the story? This crazy woman with the worst haircut I've ever seen decided to walk in the middle of our shooting. She had other spaces to walk. Many because spaces. we were in a public space on a sidewalk with yeah. people. Yeah. Wide sidewalk. So why she couldn't, I don't know, walk around the street very skinny <laughs> or walk in the street because there was no traffic. Just straight or, ahead. I don't know what. She could have done anything. We kept her mouth shut, but she decided to scream at us. Because she needed to go. By the way, case. you guys, you I probably. Think it was because of the hair. You. It was probably. By the way, guys, I never. Um, I vlogged it. Because well, first of all, I didn't vlog it. I, we were in the situation while I was vlogging, and it got recorded by mistake. But I didn't include it because I didn't want like my vlog to include this. But maybe one day I'll feature it, you know, in one of the vlogs or whatever. Maybe. Maybe. All right, you guys, so I had a lot of food. I have to thank the owners at Pig Bleaker. The restaurant is amazing. And one thing I want to say, I mean, the fact that you also offer vegetarian food, in which I did not order specifically. They have these mussels there that are to die for, and the ravioli is a, a, a huge crowd pleaser. Not your typical barbecue restaurant. It is very different, I would say, compared to other barbecue restaurants that I've been to. But make sure you check it out. It's on 155 Bleaker Street in New York City. So, Alexis and I just left the pig bleaker on Bleaker Street. Oh my gosh, you guys. I don't know if you can hear me from the last video, but uh, please try that ravioli. <sighs> my heart. Right, and we're also low key tired because we've been working all day. All but, week. Um, all week. It's Saturday, yeah. honey, and we have been going. Our Saturday is a Monday for some people in regards to work for. 
Does it make sense? It's just a lot. It's a lot. <laughs> but it's a good blessed a lot. Honey, nothing but blessings. Nothing, nothing but, blessings. but blessings. By the way, I do want to also add one more thing. That God keeps on dropping in blessings like they're hot. Drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. <laughs> So now we're about to have a little um, situation that we're about to go meet somebody for business. I don't think I'm going to vlog it at all. Um, this is just a personal business thing that we have to do. Um, and then after that, who knows? So stay tuned to the vlog of the SB, of the boy, of the CB, of the CB boy, of the boy. Mr. Boy T. Turning into a man. Okay, that was weird. Whatever. Stay tuned, guys. Bye. <laughs> show in Detroit tomorrow so I'm heading there today leaving well I'm about to leave New York City I enjoyed it here as you can see I take my hair out I'm all natural with a braid right now but yes yeah, so I'm about to get up head to Detroit and get ready to do my show <laughs> Alright you guys, so I just arrived in Detroit for my show and which is happening tomorrow, which is Sunday. Today is Saturday. I'm very excited going directly from New York here to Detroit. Haven't been here in, I don't know, two years. Um, I guess right now I'm heading to Easton Market. Um, I'm not exactly sure what I'm doing because I haven't got my schedule yet, but I'm very excited. And uh, yeah, so let's see what's going on today. All right, you guys, so I just arrived here to the venue, Market 5, where I'm gonna be headlining. I'm so excited right now. You have to see how spacious this place is. First of all, you know your venue is big when you can pull trucks in it. By the way, the runway is like 80 feet long or something ridiculous. So my models are gonna have to strut because you know I'm gonna put them in something ridiculous. So stay tuned to that. Uh, while I walk into the liquor store and like I'm stumbling and then who is that? So good morning. It is now day two here in Detroit in which is Sunday and I'm preparing to headline my show. I'm so excited guys. I'm so excited. The runway as you saw yesterday was being built. I don't know any updates. I'm sure everything's fine but like it's crazy because they had to stop working on it last night to focus on um doing something else it's just a lot it's a lot of moving parts here but i'm actually getting ready to head out and uh go to the venue so i can start setting up my show this is actually my second show in detroit in life um the first one was with walk and now i'm here for the second time and i'm headlining again and i'm really excited 80 foot plus runway and um yeah so i'm about to meet with the crew the team and figure out the schedule so that's bad. Like you didn't need to change 21. You're only young so long, so so want to pay your bills right now. It's just doing pay up jobs. Okay, you guys, I want to thank you for watching this vlog. Of course, as usual, it's hard for me to be on the runway and work <laughs> and also vlog, but I want to just include enough footage as possible. Um, thank you guys once again for watching so much. This is now Vlog 10, NYC and Detroit. I am heading to Atlanta next, um, actually in two days, to prepare for my Atlanta show with Walk and a long list of other things. So I started to realize it's best that I merge my vlogs together instead of them being completely separated um, by city. So now I'm going to just start merging them. So thank you again for watching and yeah, like, share and subscribe. Peace.